Look at that. See that gap right there? Wouldn't it just look so nice if it just stayed up like that? Today, I'm gonna help you fix that once and for all. Here's the sitch. You're gonna order on Amazon, link below in the description. Order your industrial low profile strength um, one inch wide Velcro. You're gonna get a big strand of it, you're gonna cut it out. Um, I bought this at my local Walmart, but it is not ideal. So order it in the link below so you can cut it to your specs. Here's the Velcro, I'm gonna tear it apart. You kinda need to like fold it in half like this. Peel one side off. I'm gonna use the hairier side first. And then this is gonna go on the inside right here. Take this side, go ahead and just put it, Velcro it to itself. Then you don't have to line it up. And then just push it into the back of the seat. All right, the first problem I'm running into, when you pull it off, it's pulling the residue off, not the Velcro separating. I don't really know what to do about that. Cause you can't, you can only press this in so hard. I'm just gonna let it sit there for a minute. All right, I'm using a screwdriver to separate it. All right, use the flathead to separate it. I'm just gonna let this sit here, just make sure that's gonna stick. I'm gonna leave it separated overnight, and tomorrow should hold. Just a quick little video to help you fix your saggy seat pocket, whatever you wanna call it, because it drives me absolutely nuts. It might drive some of you absolutely nuts. It might not drive any of you nuts at all. But, you know, I love when it's like a new car and everything's like laced up really tight. There's no like sagging, like, I'm all about making old cars look new again, so thank you guys for watching. See you in the next video. Later.